everybody. Hope you're having a fantastic New York Comic Con. Bluefin here. We are excited to be ripping our new jerseys. I did not get the memo. I went away jersey. They went home jersey, which is ironic because I am actually at Bluefin right now, and they're, they're remote. <laughs> How dare they? We should have switched. But I hope everyone's having a fantastic Comic-Con. Uh, just to get it out of the way right off the bat, go to bluefinbrands.com for all of these exclusives and all of these bundles that we're going to be talking about. One of the things we're most excited about is our New York Comic-Con Super Duper Ultra Mega giveaway. Justin, tell them about that. Sure, absolutely. Uh, just visit bluefinbrands.com slash contest. And as David said, we are having an NYCC Ultimate Giveaway where we're actually giving away $5,000 in prizes, and there will be one grand prize winner that will get $3,000 in prizes. Right. It's going to be incredible. Hopefully you have room in your house or basement or attic or what have you because it's a lot of stuff. Yeah, just to put that in perspective, all of this stuff is like six to $700. So, you know, 5000 <laughs> is like seven times all of this. So, uh, you know, it's a... Uh, it's going to be, and this is, these are some of the more expensive items. So it's going to be, it's going to be quite a crate. It's going to come. It's going to be like a mummy, like in a sarcophagus. Uh, but you don't have to worry about opening. This one will be safe to open. It'll be like four people carrying it, like the Ark in Indiana Jones, <laughs> arriving to your house. It'll be great. No right. problem. It, it looks like there's a lot of ways to enter too. That's yes, cool. there are 34 ways to enter. Some of which you can do wow. daily too. By the way. Um, oh. Certain certain tasks that you can just visit this website, watch this video, what have you, and um, it's super easy. It takes two seconds. Um, all you do is put in your email address so it can keep track of you and your entries. And we will, we will announce the winner via live stream next week, so no need to hit us up every couple seconds. Hey, <laughs> uh, we will definitely let you know when we pick the winner. Uh, make sure to follow at Bluefin Brands. You know that's the best way to keep on track of all of our products, all of our live streams, and stuff like that. Uh, and we'll make a, a big announcement there. It wouldn't be New York Comic Con if Tamashi did not bring the goods, and this year they definitely did so. We have two premium Bandai items that are opening during New York Comic Con. The first one being the continuation of our Misha line with the Mandalorian. Oh my gosh, everyone loves Mandalorian. Mandalorian is so hot right now, like Hansel. Justin, <laughs> tell me about this Mondo figure. Yeah, no, he looks fantastic. Uh, I know everyone was uh, was clamoring at uh, New York Comic Con last year when we had we had revealed like an Akbar and an IG eighty eight I think is the other ones that we had there yeah. and um, you know uh, the Mandalorian was starting right when we were going off on our con adventures in New York so it was always really exciting and the build up to it and to have a, a Mandalorian Mayshow figure is just incredible I mean look at the detail on that guy he looks he looks glorious. Uh, David, what, what strikes you about this uh, this figure? It, you're showing the blaster there. That's you know kind of the most iconic thing I think from the Mandalorian outside of the child, aka Baby Yoda. But right. What do you love about this figure? Well, I mean, anything Mandalorian is good, but I I, I really like the the, the whole uh, the, the whole make show look. Um, I really like the the rifle. Uh, it's it's pretty cool. I like the I believe it's the it's the uh, the, the, the little dart things he throws. He has on his leg and then on, on his chest too, which are are, are pretty cool. Um, the sword is awesome, and the cape. Capes are cool, so <laughs> capes are always cool, especially in New York. Yeah, you, you need it's good cape weather in New York. Yeah, definitely. But then, yeah, the, like I said, the, the, those are the accessories that he, that he comes with. So I think it's pretty awesome. He'll look good next to Boba Fett and Django. <laughs> yeah, what, what's that you, AJ? Well, I really like uh, the head sculpt. Uh, I think there's something really neat about it. Uh, like there's like part of like the head has like that little cover but then you have like this whole thing on the top just the sculpt itself uh on the figure is amazing especially with again the cape you know can't go wrong with capes so that's my favorite thing to do justin who designed these awesome figures it's oh. <laughs> <laughs> a really good question um it is legendary sculptor takayuki takea actually and it's all based on uh, traditional samurai armor and that's how it is inspired and it looks glorious i mean the cool thing about these figures is that you know, we recognize immediately that they're Star Wars because they have that familiarity to them. But at the same time, they also just exude the the badassness that is a samurai warrior. Mm -hmm. Absolutely yeah, amazing. And so, yeah, these are these will be available for pre-order uh, during New York Comic Con. Uh, it is going to be one hundred dollars, and it will be on premium Bandai. So, p-bandai.com/us uh, is where you can pre-order this bad boy. Uh, and while you're there, they have another item that's opening for pre-order right at t right in time for your Comic Con, and that is going to be the highly anticipated and very very sought after SH Figure Arts for Raditz. People just they just love the look, they love this character, 
Uh, he's kind of like the last of like the, the first set of Saiyans we saw that uh, has not come to the line, and uh, now it is coming. And AJ, Raditz, are you thrilled? I am really excited. I think uh, we've been getting a lot of the Dragon Ball line, but then we get back now a Dragon Ball Z character like Raditz, and it's great to have, especially with, you know, not so many Goku. You know, we have a lot of Gokus already, so let's throw in a Raditz. Uh, so now your uh, dioramas can look even better now. Awesome. Uh, and, D- David, I think you're the uh, you're the old school uh, Dragon Ball fan amongst us. Uh, Raditz, <laughs> you pumped? It, you get ready it's... to put him next to your nap and your Vegeta? And I guess I'm glad. Him, but... I'm, I'm glad to see him back, you know. You know, he 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 was in the Broly movie for like five seconds. I'm like, yay, Raditz is. <laughs> they still remember he exists, so that was pretty cool. But I, I'm glad he's a he's an SHF now. I, I can't wait to recreate the uh, the first time Goku ever died with him now. So. <laughs> yeah does he does he come with a hole in his chest that you can put in there <laughs> for the special beam cannon? Battle damage. Yeah. No, but I, but I have gunpla tools. So there you go. <laughs> Drill right through him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What do you say, Justin? Anything? Uh, anything about Raditz stand out to you? Um, I love his hair. I, I think I think he is ready for any uh, '80s hair band. He will yeah. he will rock out with his tail out, and I think it'll be great. Yeah, you can storm it, put on some warrant or some rat, you know, <laughs> yeah. snake or something. He looks incredible. Look, I, honestly, uh, the SHF figures just look like they were pulled right out of the the cartoon and uh, yeah. it's it's fantastic i mean he literally looks like they just brought a cell to life and um he looks fantastic very excited yeah, for this and, raditz figure and like the mandalorian raditz will be on premium bandai uh starting uh during new york comic-con on the 8th uh and uh, he will be 70 dollars. so uh jump on oh, that nice. and while you're there and you're already getting dragon ball stuff from premium bandai you might as well get uh, one of the other offerings that's currently available for pre-order and that is raccoon uh, the third member of the Ginyu Force offered is an SH figure arts, of course. Ginyu came out earlier in the year. Uh, the pre-order for Jis just ended uh, a couple weeks ago. And now you can get the mighty Raccoon. Who, who rhymes with so many different words, right, Justin? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dome, boom. Zoom, uh, oh, zoom. <laughs> Raccoon is awesome, man. Like, the, the poses you can pull off with this guy. Like, everyone knew that when, when, you know, when they announced the Ginyu Force. They were going to have to be able to pull off the most incredible poses, and they, they did it. I love that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They should come with a piece yeah. of candy. <laughs> <laughs> and he's got just a ton of accessories, right, AJ? Yeah, I think uh, he also comes with a Ginyu for us, uh, or Captain Ginyu's uh, frog uh, head. So that's something to add on to. If you already have Ginyu and Captain Ginyu, you might as well get this, so you can get that as special you know, addition to it. Absolutely. And we have Ginyu. He'll be available on our site during New York Comic Con, I believe. Cool. Yeah, there'll be a special promotion with uh, the Kaioken Goku and Ginyu. Uh, you get that as a bundle during the, uh, the event. Perfect. In addition to that, um, you know, we are fortunate enough to where we have some restocks on some of our San Diego Comic Con exclusives that sold so well. Uh, we're going to have the uh, the Godzilla, the, uh, the blue version that we had at San Diego Comic Con, as well as Figure Art Zero statues for Brawly and Vegito. So uh, bluefinbrands.com will have all of that, as well as uh, several bundles. You can see right here we have the Dragon Ball Dragon Ball Legends bundle. You know, you're going to get Tao Popeye, you're going to get Piccolo, you're going to get Sun Goku, you're going to get Bulma, you're going to get the Dragon Raider, all for $200. It's an $85 savings. The uh, the Dragon Raider is a, one of the Propica. Uh, the others are SH figure arts. Dragon Raider plays, you know, sights and sounds and does all of this really, really fun and cool stuff. And, uh, you know, uh, amaze your friends, play the game, and have fun. Uh, also, the Mesha line, uh, all Star Wars Mesha are going to be two for $100. So get your Kylo Ren, get your Stormtroopers, your 3PO's, your Snow Troopers, you know, mix and match, army build. Uh, we talked the other day about, you know, there's no, nothing saying you can't army build Kylo Ren or Darth Vader. You know, you can have an army of whatever you want. It's your, toy, your toys, your collectibles. Do what you want. We got a Goku special. We got Kyle Ken Goku and Ultra Instinct Goku together. Uh, they are going to be $70. Uh, for the two of them, we have, like I said, another one that's going to be the Ginyu, Captain Ginyu and Kaioken Goku, uh, as well as a couple Marvel ones. You know, we have uh, the Final Battle <laughs> Ultimate Edition Spider-Man and Endgame uh, Hulk. Uh, and so, yeah, bluefinbrands.com is where you're going to find all of the exclusives, all of the promotions, and all the bundles. Oh, and I almost forgot, Ultraman. Everybody likes Ultraman. This is for, these, are, these are the three from the Netflix show. You, know, you got Ultraman, you got the Ultraman uh, version 7, and the, the Belmar, Bel- Belmar. 
Uh, these are going to be $100 for the three of them. Uh, original MSRP is $204, so you're saving $104, so order 50% uh, off this set. So don't wait. Get it now. Sticking with figures, we have Storm Collectibles. They make a ton of amazing figures and collectibles for video games. You know, Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter, uh, Golden Axe. You know, that's one of the new IPs. Justin, tell us about it. All right. First up on the docket here is the Golden Axe Skeleton 2-Pack, and these guys are amazing. The articulation on these guys never ceases to amaze me. Um, there's people that, that share these on social media with the fun poses. Some of them are relaxing. It's like a weekend at Bernie sort of setting, and it's fantastic. <laughs> and uh, you can never have too many skeletons. And what's cool about these ones is they're actually pink skeletons. Like, they have just been... Uh, uh, dipped in a nice little cool bath of blood, and uh, yeah. love these guys to death. Definitely want to get your hands with, on uh, this. They also come with a different set of weapons than the original one. So, right. you know, yeah, if you want a new set of weapons, these are the ones. Yeah, these are like crazy looking scythe type deals. Yeah, very pointy. Nice. Can, gonna have a bad time <laughs> if you get attacked <laughs> by one of them. You wanna have a bad time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, next on the list, we have. Uh, Homaru, uh, this guy, um, this is from Samurai Showdown, and um, this is a new version of him. You'll see that he's wearing uh, red instead of the white. Uh, very excited about this guy. You can see he comes with his sword, uh, the effect, and multiple hand parts. Um, like Raditz, he also has really cool hair going for him. <laughs> and he is actually going to go for $90. He will be available uh, for order on bluefinbrands.com. Nice. And then next on the list is E Honda, one of our favorites, one of the best sumo wrestlers around. Uh, you can see that this is actually uh, a new uh, version of him in his nostalgia outfit. This uh, amazing little towel getup that he's got going on with his uh, blast effect with his fists, um, multiple hands. Uh, it doesn't get any better than this guy, man. I I absolutely love this whole like bathhouse diorama thing that they got going on. Like it literally just looks like it's pulling it from the game. It's, Dipping his little salt and um, it just looks fantastic. Right, mm. one of, one of the long waited ones is Motaro, and uh, this is actually a bloody version of him. Uh, this is a special exclusive for New York Comic Con. You can see he comes with a green skull, so you can add another skull <laughs> to your skeleton <laughs> to your collection. Rather, uh, he's got his uh, little uh, tail blast effect part uh, as well as multiple hands. This guy is a big dude. You are going to need some room on your shelf for Motaro. Yeah, I'm he, uh, very excited like for this guy. Nine inches tall or something, more than that. He yeah, does not tall. like skeletons. No. I think no. he just yeah. ripped that skeleton out of somebody's body. <laughs> it should just come with a little pile of mush underneath. <laughs> oh, wait. Isn't there a pile of mush? What is that? That, that red thing? That says, uh, I think it's uh, a tail blast. blast. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah. We can make it a pile of mush, I suppose. We could make a pile of mush. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you could just leave it on the ground. We'll get you a pile of mush ground. by 3 o'clock today. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mazaro's actually going to go for 110 uh, Again, this is a bloody exclusive edition, uh, right. only available during New York Comic Con. Very excited for this guy. Uh, can't wait to get my hands on this dude. This will go yeah, great with your bloody Shao Kahn and your bloody Goro mm -hmm. if you have one. Mm. Yeah, and I think a lot of people they're you know they're they're desperately trying to get either Goro or Shao Kahn because they missed out during like the first offering. And, you know, it's worth noting a lot of times Storm doesn't do a lot of reissues, so especially on the big guys. So if you want to get, uh, you know, Motaro, now is the time. Uh, don't be like people kicking themselves for not getting Goro, like Justin. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wait. Every day. <laughs> there, there's a bloody Shao Kahn? Yeah. That's, I have that's a regular I Shao Kahn, like an idiot. Oh, my God. <laughs> <Just now. laughs> Yeah, uh, I mean it's like it's like baseball. You don't want to root for the guy with the clean jersey. You gotta get he hasn't been working. You gotta get the one with the dirty jersey. Right, no, get their hands dirty. Uh, but all these exclusives are available at BluefinBrands.com during New York Comic Con. Nice. And then AJ, you have a lot of fans screaming at you. Um, you had, of course, you handle the um, the storm. Uh, yeah. Social channels and everyone's clamoring for more exclusives, and you're going to be excited to know that that the door is not going to be pounding on the other end anymore for people screaming for exclusives. Yeah, I think uh, you know once we uh, put these out, these will go by real fast. I think our the storm fans are storm fans for a reason. <laughs> right. <laughs> then I come back. Like, like, give me more. Give me more. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They're like now yeah. you gave us this, we're going to need that. So yeah. Come to Tuesday after New York Comic Con. They're like, so what, what's next? Right. <laughs> yeah. 
like Goldberg in the early 2000s and WCW, like, who's next? Yeah. <laughs> no, that's one of the cool things about collecting, right, is, is it's addicting. And once you start yeah. licking your lips and scratching, you need more exclusives. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome. Never content, right? Nope. We always want the next thing. Always. Yeah. I get, I get my stuff in the mail and I'm like, oh, this is great. I'm going to enjoy this for four seconds before I start thinking, <laughs> what else can I put next to it? Exactly. Uh, but the packaging is always really cool on Storm Collectibles. Uh, you can see yeah. on David's uh, desk there. You know, they're they're wrapped very safely in plastic. They have really cool box art, and it shows everything that they come with on there. They look really, really cool. Um, mm-hmm. And people that don't like to open up their boxes, uh, one of the sides always shows the figure uh, painted on there. It looks really, really cool. Uh, and mm-hmm. then the other side, yeah, like that. Uh, they look great when they're on a shelf together. So be sure to check out all these Storm exclusives on BluefinBrands.com during New York, to- er, New York Comic Con. <laughs> <laughs> We're excited to have Flame and Sentinel's brand manager actually with us, Mr. Clark. Hey! He runs those two brands. What is Sentinel and Flame bringing to New York Comic Con this year? Bringing the heat. So we, we have uh, we have some new stuff that is just started on pre-order that you can get even if you don't do anything in New York Comic Con. So we'll start with that. You know, this is for everybody out there on the planet. Um, you guys realize a couple months ago we did launch a new line of Marvel figures with Sentinel. Uh, this is uh, this is the Iron Man that actually just closed. Uh, shout out to our friend Jay. Uh, who does a lot of our photography for us. He did some really cool shots of the Iron Man, uh, which will be coming out uh, very soon. Uh, yeah, they, I mean, just really great. They're, they're very flexible. It's like a real person in armor, uh, which is fantastic. Uh, you can pull up a lot of crazy iconic poses. So, like, I'm really excited for this line. Uh, and so, you know, we're excited to, to announce that, you know, uh, during your Comic-Con and for, like, the next couple of weeks, you'll be able to pre-order the next release, which will be the Iron Spider. Uh, and as Justin likes to always point out, yes, this one has four legs <laughs> on the back. Uh, <laughs> uh, so this, this, this guy is going to be $95. Um, he comes with optional webs, uh, optional hands. Uh, he also comes with a really cool stand, so you'll be able to do all the aerial poses. And the thing that always just impresses me with, with, with Sentinel is that they're able to just recreate all the, like, the high posability of these characters. I mean, just like... That one pose right there on the right for Spider-Man, like that's that's not an easy pose <laughs> to get mm-hmm. in the figure, and you know these figures have die-cast parts too, so you know they, they're they're gonna feel heavy. Like you could throw this at a zombie and like end it probably. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I'm 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 looking real forward to this, and you know later down the line uh, next year we have Wolverine, Captain America, and Deadpool all coming to this line too. So uh, wow. it should be should be pretty pretty fun. So, have you guys had a chance to to, to look at it, the, the Iron Man? I know it came in and went to Jay real fast, but did you guys get a chance to even see the box? No. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Well, no it'll like, be back David, soon. Send it, send it out instantly. I don't want anyone looking at it or touching your feelings. You get it from Jay. <laughs> if Jay's not the next person who puts his eyes on this, I'm going to raise all heck. But, yeah. to be fair, I mean, yeah. you did fantastic. That figure's so heavy, it's breaking rocks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So yeah, no. So I'm I'm really looking forward to that. So you know, definitely check that out, everybody. Uh, and then for Flame, we do have Bug Bites. Oh, now, bug bite. I before oh, we get yeah. further, David, in like a couple seconds, tell the people out there who is Bug Bite. Well, he's obviously a white and purple version of Bumblebee, right? <laughs> but he's so much more. Bug Bite is actually the first GoBot that Flame Toys is going to be making. Uh, you know, GoBots, which actually came out before Transformers, uh, had a similar concept. You know. You know, uh, alien uh, robots that transformed into various things. You know, and Bugbite was one of their uh, one of the evil renegades. And uh, when Hasbro bought Tonka and they brought the uh, GoBot line into their 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 ilk, uh, Bugbite was one of the first ones that they actually brought over into the mainstream continuity. And uh, now we have uh, IDW uh, Bugbite here. Yeah, and the cool thing is. Uh... If you guys saw the, the latest trailer for the second part for War for Cybertron on Netflix, uh, Bug Bite is in there. Uh, and it looks like he's going to actually fight Bumblebee. Uh, oh, man. I mean, I'm, I'm happy to see how it goes. I mean, we all we, we know Bumblebee is not going to die. I mean, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's cool. So, like, in, in, in the Netflix series, he's, he's, a, he's a mercenary. So he's not, not a Decepticon just yet. So it'll be exciting to see how he... Uh, how he performs in his Netflix debut. <laughs> he's going to put DEET in his window washer fluid and he's going to spray it all over. <laughs> <Bug bite. laughs> Spraying Bumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> but 
yeah, no, pre- pretty excited for uh, <laughs> this and, uh, and also for the Sentinel stuff. So cool. yeah, check it out. Cool. And I'm excited to see more Decepticons coming online because we all know Decepticons are infinitely better than Autobots. It's just, it's just a fact. They are cooler. And then, uh, oh, we, we, do, we do have one more thing for Sentinel, though, before we, before we go any further. So... Just, Yo, skipping, skipping, skipping. Skipping, skipping, skipping. Uh, we do have a deal, uh, correct, David? About we the, sure do. Uh, illumination galleries. Let me go ahead and uh, full screen. So to me, hi everybody. <laughs> so hey, look how big you are. So a- anything you buy Marvel during our event on our on our site, you will get a free illumination gallery. Uh, nice. These have so we, we have wave one and wave two. Which has characters like Ultron, Captain America, as you can see here, Captain America, Iron Man, Vision, Thor, all kinds of different characters. Uh, awesome, they they light up. Uh, they have different uh, modes where, like you know, if you walk by it, it'll light up for a little bit. Um, there's another mode where if the lights go off in your room, the light will come on for a certain amount of time, uh, or you just have it always on. It depends on how many batteries you'd like to run through. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's it's a lot like the collector in Guardians of the Galaxy. They're in a in a giant, uh, it looks like a glass case, basically. Yeah. Like they're on display. Like you captured this hero, and now they're your prized possession, and and they're in your room. Yeah, they look great. you can take the uh, the top. Actually, you take it top, top off, and you can like you look at the figure close up as well. What if they escape? Uh, they're away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and you have what a villain. Movie. Are you gonna be? Living <laughs> toy, and that's cool. <laughs> But yeah, uh, that's also a thing you can do uh, during our sale. So anything you know to celebrate comic books, anything Marvel you buy, you get a free little Marvel Illumination Gallery to go along with it. So cool. perfect. Yeah, so that'll count the Marvel Me Show figures. I know this is the Star Wars one, but a Marvel Me Show figure, uh, Marvel SH figure arts. You know, like I said, mentioned earlier, we have the Hulk and uh, Iron Spider bundle. Uh, any Sentinel? Sentinel has the Iron Spider um, and maybe some soft final items as well. Any of those Marvel items that you purchase will come with a free elimination gun. Perfect. Oh. So you can have your own little villain or hero in a glass case, so like a case of emergency, just throw to the ground and they <laughs> come alongside so they defend you or murder you, depending on who they are. So just add water. water. In addition to uh, Bug Bites model, we also have some Bandai hobby items. So, David, we have a pair of uh, hobby exclusives to show off. Uh, so take it away. This is the RX-78 Beyond Global Clear version, correct? Yes, yeah. So this is a clear version of the kit that came out a little while ago. Um, very flexible, uh, awesome kit. Now it's clear. Uh, so definitely, you know, uh, if you uh, if you like this design, definitely pick it up. It's it's really good just on the engineering. Um, so I would definitely not not sleep on that. Um, pretty hyped for it. Uh, and then we also yes, yeah, uh, which is a, which is a really really, really good price. Uh, I'm looking forward to getting one and uh, filling it with LEDs. <laughs> so, Ooh. You gotta fill it with yeah. fish and watch the fish swim around inside. <laughs> oh god, the poor fish. <laughs> uh, uh, but then another one that's, that we have that uh, if you're a Gundam fan, you've got to get this just because of you know what it means. Is we have the memorial pack, uh, which is you know celebrating 40 years of Gunpla. Uh, you know, so from left to right, we have the original RX-78 from the 1980s. Um, the first one, you, you can see, we come a long way, y'all. We come, we come a long way. <laughs> that first one. Then we have the RX-78 high grade uh, from the 2000s, which uh, it's got like, a special uh, coating on it, which is cool. Uh, and then, you know, representing more of the modern era, we have the real great RX-78 uh, with some clear parts. So you can, uh, at some parts, you can see inside to the inner, the detailed inner frame, uh, which is pretty cool. So um, all three are going to come in, the, in this one pack, which is pretty cool. And I believe this is uh, left and right. It could be mirror images. What? I said left and right. It looks the same. I mean, oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, no, yeah. Like that. Same same energy. Same energy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 40, Forty years is a long time to uh, improve yeah, on the technology, and I mean, even in the last like two years, uh, I feel like we're just constantly seeing new ways oh, yeah. for them to do the joints, to do the movements, the articulation, everything. It's fantastic. Oh yeah. I tell you, as someone who's been building for over twenty years, dude, it's a uh, it, it's crazy every time like they they would update technology i'm like oh man this is so much better than before and then like <laughs> when, when, when it's even better you're like man how did i survive in the old times right. you know like and then i can't wait to see what, what they have next i'm sure next will they'll be like actual moving gun block which i'm you know hobby i'm ready for that so. moving joints right. anytime <laughs> give, it a little, give it a little shock and it'll just start moving <laughs> 
And then this is $54 for the 40th anniversary. Correct. That's a great deal. And we have one more thing to show you uh, from our friends over at Studio Ghibli. We have the glider from Nausicaa. And it's, this is something that uh, we, we, we brought over recently. This is something we've been getting a lot of comments and a lot of people just like, wow. Some people don't even know what this is from. They're like, that glider looks really cool. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. this, uh, uh, this is $98. Uh, it's a very, very limited production run. Uh, so if you love Studio Ghibli, you love Nausicaa, you love, you know, just, this just has like a different look and feel than like most collectibles or toys, you know, especially the things that we offer. And uh, you know, just looking at it, I'm like, I want to know more. It's like Starship Troopers, right, Justin? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you would like to know more. No, it's fantastic. And, and as you said, this is a very low quantity number that we have on these guys. And we're very excited to be able to to get a few more for you for New York Comic Con. So don't miss out. I think that is it as far as, you know, all of the great exclusives and stuff we're going to be bringing to New York Comic Con. Uh, again, make sure to go to bluefinbrands.com to see all of the exclusives, all of the bundles, the promotions, everything that we have to offer. And while you're there, make sure to enter our contest. Because remember, we give only a $5,000 for the prizes. One mega winner is going to win $3,000 of prizes just on his own. I can't even visualize what the crate's going to look like that we're going to send this poor guy's house oh, or person's house. Uh, and, uh, you know, like Justin keeps saying, now it's, it's their problem. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. Good luck with that. Man, it's going to be great. Uh, and, and, I hope that all of these collectibles find a really nice home. I think it's going to be fantastic. And uh, it'll be fun to, for maybe you, if you win, to make a fun video showing all the really cool stuff and, and what it is that you got. Basking in all your loot. Maybe taking a bath in it like Scrooge McDuck. Uh, I think that would be a lot of fun. All right. Absolutely. We haven't even started. We already got like 1,100 entr entries. Yeah. So we haven't even started to promote this huh. yet, Ed. Left know, reloaded. We are not responsible for any fights this may cause with your husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, parents, <laughs> grandparents, significant others. Whoever you're living with, it's not our fault if we send this huge box and they, they look at you like, where are you from all this? Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's going to be great. I, I think yeah. you'll have a blast. And remember, there's multiple ways to enter. It says right here, 34 ways to enter. A lot of it's just following uh, various people on social media, going to Facebook, Instagram, uh, YouTube, uh, all easy stuff that only takes a few seconds. And you can see that some of them are noted uh, per one per day. So it's all things that you can just increase your chances on winning. So be sure to do that and don't miss out. You don't want to kick yourself for not giving yourself all the opportunities you could to win this amazing stuff. Absolutely. And... Just to, just to make it easy for you, follow at Bluefin Brands. Uh, you know, Justin and AJ tweeting at a storm, I'm sure. They will make sure to let you, to remind you that you can do this contest daily to make sure that you have done the contest and to also help remind you of all of the great products and promotions. You know, we have, we have I, I want to say, like 150 different items we're putting on sale this event. It's, uh, I think, our largest digital event we've ever thrown. Uh, so we can't wait to, to share this with you. Uh, also at bluefinbrands.com, we have a schedule of our live streams. We're going to be doing several live streams, some with like the four of us, where we're going to be doing some fun rankings, like, the, like Marvel movies and stuff like that, in honor of New York Comic Con. We'd love for you to be part of that and to uh, you know express your uh, your appreciation for our accuracy. Let us let us know what kind of crazy yahoos we are, uh, and you never know. A lot of times in our live streams, we give away prizes. So you know, watch the live stream. You know, if nothing else, you might win a free prize, and you know, might. Just listen to us talk about how great this movie is versus that. Right. So, the Thor, um, Thor Dark World is David's favorite <laughs> Marvel yeah. movie. Oh, no, it's the best. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You've been disqualified immediately. It's a fun one. <laughs> it is well, not. I'm trying to know which David it is. And and you there like Ang Lee's one. Hulk and, oh. and the that, Poodles. <laughs> <Fair enough. laughs> yeah. no. All the you're good hurting, stuff. You're hurting David <laughs> over here. Oh. So yeah, so make sure to watch those live streams uh, and uh, you know to interact with us on the social platforms. Like I said, at Bluefin Brands, you know we're at Tomashi Nation, we're at all of these ones. At Bluefin Brands is our, our central hub, and uh, you know they'll do the, the the crossing guard. They'll direct you here and here and here and here. So uh, until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic New York Comic Con, and I can't wait for you to share your halls with us uh, on social media. So 